G'day YouTube. This video will show you guys how to perform a really simple backup of your data on Linux Mint 17.3. So without further ado, I'll get into it. So starting off, what we want to do is find the backup tool. Now it is there installed by standard on Linux Mint. So just go to your little menu there, start menu, and go across to backup tool. And this is the app. Now it will ask you to throw in a password. So throw your password in there. Now there's uh, many things, but uh, this is just a very simplistic video to show you guys one very simple way to backup your files. So for the backup tool, select backup files, select source. Now most likely you might go to other, you might go to your home directory. Let's pretend we are backing up pictures. So everything in the pictures folder and destination. Now this can be anywhere else on your system, but most likely you want it to be a, uh, a removable drive. Now I don't have a removable drive here at the moment. So just for the moment, let's pretend I do and call this uh, removable drive. Yeah, that's fine. And let's pretend I'm pointing to a removable drive. Now advanced options, uh, a couple of things here. Give it a description, don't really need to. Output preserve structure or create as a, a tar file or a tar.bz2 file, so a zip file. Let's just preserve, uh, preserve structure in this case. Overwrite, uh, I wouldn't worry too much about this. Uh, this is um, if you're rewriting over a folder directory, that sort of thing, but let's just, let's just leave it as the default for now. Now, yeah, sure, confirm integrity, preserve permissions, preserve timestamps, that sounds like a good one actually, and uh, follow sim links. Now, I've, I've got a recent video about uh, symbolic links, so yeah, let's do that as well, but it's not really needed. Uh, let's go to forward and then exclude or exclude any folders or directories from that pictures folder that I've previously set to backup. No, nope, that's fine, leave it as is. Then we go forward and we'll say source from pictures to my removable drive click apply and then let's have a look. So yeah, it does all that. In fact, as we're waiting for that, oh no, all done. We'll close down and let's go to the home drive and have a look. So that was removable drive. Here we go. So there's all the stuff right there. So that's pretty much it in a nutshell, guys. Uh, that is how you copy or backup files from your anywhere in your home directory or anywhere else on your machine to a removable disk, for example. Uh, really simple utility. Uh, there's a few extra features I haven't really gone into there. But uh, yeah, this is just a really basic method of how to do it. Um, I'm sure I'll throw up some more videos later on a more uh, complex way to do it. But this will just get you started. All right, cheers, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. Thanks for your time.